Dude, I actually can't believe Pete Alonzo. For anybody that didn't watch the home run derby last night, Pete Alonzo won it for the second time in a row since they didn't have it last year because of COVID. This guy is a straight savage, man. He was beating Trey Mancini in the finals, a guy who just beat cancer. There was a kid in the outfield who tore his ACL trying to field a ball, and the only thing Pete Alonzo could do is sit there and bob his head to the music as he's just mashing 500-foot home runs. Nothing against Pete at all. That guy's a machine. His interview after the Derby might have been one of the worst interviews I've ever heard in my entire life. But dude, he was sending balls into orbit at the end of that. I was a little disappointed Shohei got bounced, but he gave us like, what, a three round first round? They went to triple sudden death because he had that huge comeback at the beginning. Joey Gallo got bounced right away. That was a little bit weird too. But I wanted Otani to win. He didn't. Alonzo won. I'm pretty cool with that. I just think he's a little bit inconsiderate. Not inconsiderate, but like he just did not care about anything yesterday. That man was there for one reason and one reason only, just to hit bombs. How can you not love the Derby, man? What's up guys? Uh, I guess you're gonna kind of get two intros. Uh, Buxton's fat ass is laying back there as you can see. So I'm editing and yeah, the first basically game in nine eighths of the next game, there's no audio for so I'm not even gonna put the gameplay in here because it's just like deafeningly loud. Because for the intro cutscene I turned the game volume all the way up on my Elgato and I forgot to leave it up there until I remembered it. But I was lucky enough to get it literally as I was walking up to the plate to get my first MLB hit, so that's kind of cool. But yeah, I drew a walk in my first game, and then I grounded out twice and popped up once. And then this game, I think I was going 0 for 4 with two strikeouts and I think two pop-ups. But yeah, sorry for missing kind of the start of my actual MLB career. I know I blew it. But hopefully the rest of this video makes up for it. Oh yeah, and uh, buy G Fuel. I don't have my stuff by me, but go buy G Fuel. Please. Thank you for the love of God. It happened. A double. It's going to be a triple. My God, he's on fire. <laughs> you don't get your first MLB hit every day. Come on now. Oh my God. I'm going to rob this shit too. This game is all about me. Okay, I don't think it's highlight reel worthy. I just fucking caught it. If that was Byron Buxton, I would be hurt for a month. I love you, Byron, but Jesus Christ, man. All right, we got a dub. We're kind of settling in now a little bit. We got a hit. We drew a walk the first game. We haven't made any fielding errors. I don't think they're going to send me down yet, although my average right now is absolutely terrible. Batting one for eight, horrible, horrible, horrible. Is the MLB All-Star game tonight? It is. It's at 6.30. That kind of sucks. Pretty sure there's a finals game on, and I'm, I'm not going to watch an All-Star game over a goddamn final. If I didn't care about basketball, I would, but All-Star games, like, I, they suck, man. Fuck off! Jesus Christ, that might have gone 5,000 feet. Oh, that sound! Am I getting the silent treatment? Oh, you guys are dicks. Get your asses off. Yeah, okay, that's kind of cool. <laughs> Trying to give myself a realistic stat line. Since, you know, we don't just have people throwing me shit pitches nonstop. The thing about AAA, man, it was fun, but it was just cookies. Like, everything was cookies. Although, I, I can't seem to make good, solid contact. I, yeah, I have a home run and a base hit, but... No. Oh, god damn it. Dude! I'm gonna get fucking rung up with a low breaking ball again, and I'm gonna be upset about it. Eat shit. I'm bad. I'm not that bad, though. Come on, now. Oh, God. That's not gonna get down. Fuck! Another thing I've noticed right away since coming up to the bigs. The outfielders catch every ball. They don't just stop and let them drop to give you a free hit like they did in AAA all the fucking time. I'm waiting for the right pitch because I'm power swinging. I should probably just take one here though, honestly. <sighs> I did take one. Oh! Don't strike out, don't strike out, don't strike out, don't- God damn it! I'm gonna get sent down, dude. I can't do anything. See, this is a much better looking locker room, although I feel like I'm being severely excluded from the rest of the fucking team over there. I feel like it's gonna take me like a year to get called back up, so that's my biggest fear. Oh, I don't want to play the game. They should just release this game by itself. I'd pay 60 bucks for this. This is elite. 
Hey, they're not giving me any baseballs to hit, though. If they're just going to give me fucking paper balls and these weird fucking painted ones, I don't want it. I feel like this is the ultimate hand-eye coordination test on God. Nobody's got better thumbs than me. The last guy who tried to thumb war me died. You know, I'm happy I actually did that because I needed help with the plate vision. Oh, no, man. Now he's yelling at me because my batting average sucks. I mean, we're in second in our division, which is nice to see. Shot at the playoffs here, but I've got to help our team get there. And I'm not going to do that if I just continue to ground out every fucking time. I mean, at least I'm not dropping balls, but I don't think they're going to keep me around just due to my fielding capabilities here. I need to prove a little something something. Oh, dude. Feel bad, I say dude after every time I swing the bat, but I really don't know what else to say. Cheese grater! Please don't strike out, please don't strike out. Uh. God, dude, I can't stop popping up! God damn, like do I need to play on PCI or something? I've never had to play, I've never had this issue before. It's one hell of a slump if this is a slump, but Jesus Christ, my guy. It's gonna be the worst YouTube video ever, dude. Thank you! Oh my god, we got a hit! Holy buckets! I shouldn't have swung at that. That was eight miles in the air. Dude, that was dirty! Oh! I don't know what to do. This is fucking hard, man. There we go. Another one. That'll work. See, I don't care as long as we're just getting on base. And it's not an error. Anything is better than walking back to the dugout after swinging the bat at three awful pitches and having the rest of your team stare at you like you're an idiot. Trust me, I know a thing about that in real life and in video games. Oh my god, what a play! That'll answer my question about Javi Baez. He's on the Reds? Okay. And he just hit a bomb. Nice. Okay. Hey! He does it again! Who would ever thought he'd be making catches like that after watching his debut in the uh, minors? I just want to be batting above 200, man. Ugly. Oh, that was beautiful, though. See, it's curveballs like that that I can do. If the curveball starts above the hitbox, I'm pretty good about knowing where it's going to land. It's just when they're not in the top of the hitbox. Goes to the dirt, you have no idea. Oh, no. Dude, see, I'm trying to take these pitches, and I'm getting a little bit better at it. I don't, I, I can take a pitch on things like that. I don't need to swing every time. Oh god, another one. Oh! Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go! It's huge, 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 huge! Oh no, I'm out. I'm out by a mile and three quarters. I'm gonna be out this way too. Get down, please. Thank you. Holy shit. Hit a hundred speed. I didn't think it was gonna get cut off like that though. The left fielder. Oh, that's why it hit that. I was wondering how the left fielder got there so quick. Nice. Really glad we got that out of the way. Why don't you just give me a fucking nine iron? I think I just have my expectations set too high. Two for five is not bad at all. It's actually a pretty good. All right, we'll get another game in here though, because I still feel like I have much left to do, but I don't know what to uh, level up here. I'm going to put my contact up, I think. All right, so we got one final game for this video. I'm praying that I get my shit together and just at least get two more hits this game. Like I said, my expectations might be a little bit higher, but me popping out four times a game, starting to piss me off. Contact. Contact. Oh! Thank you. God damn, man. Throwing me strikes all day too, and I just can't even hit them. That was a perfect pitch. If I would have missed that, I would have been so upset. All right, I guess I've got to take the first pitch here no matter what for this stupid challenge. I hate this one because they're always going to be strikes. See, it always is. It always is. Fuck you. Yeah. Yeah! Two for three? Holy balls, we're returning to ourself. God, I was having an outer body experience there. That was an accident waiting to happen from the moment he threw it. Let's get this win. That's what's important here is that we're not losing to the worst team in baseball. That's that's all I really care about. Obviously, me helping the team win is huge, but this is like losing to the Minnesota Twins. Oh. It was close. I shouldn't have even swung at that. Like... All right, we're going to go check out my stats super quick because, like, they're not good. Batting 222, four runs, one home run, six RBIs, eight hits, a stolen bag. 
Honestly, I'm, I'm pretty much batting the team average. Jesus Christ, this team is terrible. How are they so good? All right, guys, and that is going to be all for today's MLB Road to the Show video. I'm happy I was able to finally get to the Major League, although I know today's video was pretty bad. Like, I just did not play well, but at least we're in the MLB. I, I think as long as I'm still productive at the plate somewhat, they can keep me. I just, like I said, don't want to get sent down, but I'm going to try my best to make sure that doesn't happen. For those of you who would like to follow me on any of my social medias, the link to all of my socials will be in the description of this video as well as the address to my P.O. box. Got a bunch of mail from you guys yesterday, so thank you for starting to mail out your envelopes correctly. With all that stuff being said, guys, you already know the drill. I'm going to hop off and edit this shit so you guys can watch it on time. I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day, and as always, I will see you in the next video.